Hello, this is McGee the Beast, and this is McGee Sports 4 coming to you today with a preview of the first NFL game this season, Thursday Night Football, Packers versus Bears. Before I continue, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Please subscribe to the channel. Great. We appreciate you do that. And you won't regret it. So, this is this game is on Thursday night. Usually, the, uh, the Fang Champs get to host the... Uh, First opening night game of Thursday night, but since it's the uh, 200th, uh, I think it's like the 200th um, anniversary of this matchup, and it's the 100th uh, anniversary of the NFL. So that's why this is going to be be uh, this. That's why this game is going to be the um, the uh, game on Thursday night. It's so a intriguing matchup. You got Packers versus Bears, a Bears team. Pretty good defense. They, uh, their defensive coordinator went ahead and took the uh, Denver Broncos head coaching job. Can't fault him there. And then they decided to come in and bring in Chuck Pagano. Great hire right there. Chuck Pagano knows what he's doing as a defensive coordinator. Uh, he is kind of a fair head coach. Not completely his fault, though. I don't completely blame him there with Indianapolis. But he's going to be a great defensive coordinator. Matt Nagy, great uh, play car right there you have on the um, as your head coach and also offensive coordinator. And then you, your offense is a bit suspect. I, I do think that Mitchell Trubisky has to show more to me for me to, to uh, be sold on him. Uh, but the defense is going to be the, is going to be the uh, thing that keeps the Bears in this game. The Green Bay Packers, Aaron Rodgers on offense, new head coach Matt, uh, Matt LaFell. Uh, you also have, a, it looks like it's going to be a decent defense this year on Green Bay, at least on paper. We'll see if that um, becomes true. The running game, though, for Green Bay is non-existent, non-existent which means they're going to have to rely heavily on Aaron Rodgers. And uh, that, to me, is a minor question mark. I do think Aaron Rodgers is the second-best quarterback in this league. Um, behind Tom Brady, um, but I do f- think that also um, he needs somewhat of a running game. This is going to be, I think, kind of a low-scoring game. I went back and forth with it. You'll hear this pick on my NFL picks on Wednesday, which is tomorrow. Stay tuned for that. But I think that the Bears, this game's at home for the Chicago Bears. I think they come up on top here. I'm going to go... 20 to 17 Bears in this one. I'm going to say the Bears go ahead, win this one. Um, I don't think, th- I think both of these teams are basically even. If you watch my NFC North football predictions, I actually have both of these teams in the playoffs at 9 to 7 with the Bears winning the division. So I, personally, I just think that both of these teams are even. I'm just going to give it to the home team. That Chicago Bears crowd is going to be fired up. They're going to act like they feel like they're Super Bowl contenders, that they're a very good team, and I think that's going to be the difference. The home crowd, night game, Thursday night teams on the road seem to struggle, get, and I think the Bears just come up on top. Even though, if the, even though if it was at a neutral site, I would go Green Bay, but since it's in Chicago, give me the Bears. So that there you have it. Uh, I think this is low scoring. I think the Bears win a close one, 20 to 17. And I think the difference is the Bears defense. I just think with the Packers not having much of a running game, in my opinion, I think um, will cost them. So comment down below. Tell me what you think about this game. Always like hearing from you all. Thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Please subscribe to the channel. Greatly appreciate if you do that. Thanks for watching. McDee the Beast here signing off.